I'm talking about a comrade that therefore emerged as one of our stalwarts that as we went to the struggle as we were beginning a process they had to spend 27 years in prison it was not just an easy because he was part of a group but because he was such a comrade that many who worked with him will tell you that when it came to the issues of the ANC, you could not tell him any other thing. He lived the ANC. When the ANC wanted volunteers, he was there to be a volunteer. When the ANC wanted soldiers, he was there to be the soldiers. And of course, Mlangeni was a very was a political animal. He believed in the ANC policies. He believed in the Freedom Charter. And I'm sure as we say goodbye to him, we need to promise him that we are going to fulfill the task that was given to all of us by the people of our country, that we should implement the Freedom Charter. Because the Freedom Charter is a document that was produced by the people under the leadership of the ANC. But it says you need to change the lives of our people. We need to bring equality. We don't need to create new policies. The policies are there. I'm sure, as we used to talk to him, that we have not yet completed the, the, the implementation of the Freedom Charter so that we can change the quality of our lives. I'm sure, comrades, after 25 years, we must be as clear as anything that the answer to deal with the legacy of apartheid and poverty in our country is the implementation of the Freedom Charter. 